All right, so you said that um, Big Pharma is in control. I mean, that's how it seems. It seems like everyone that's on TV is advertising for Big Pharma. Now they're talking about going door to door, and I don't know. I, I don't know. That, that sounds like a real bad situation. The government going door to door to ask you about your medical history. Mm. They already started in some states, and it seems like they're kind of uh, targeting black communities, color communities, communities of color, so I don't know. So you think the vaccine is harmful and they're trying to target black communities and colored communities with the vaccine yeah. to do harm? Definitely, man. There's a lot of information out there. There's a lot of doctors around the world that disagree with what's going on and we're not hearing none of their voices, you know, so mm-hmm. I find that kind of weird also. No. Okay. I mean, I'm not a doctor. I'm no expert on this. Yeah, I'm no expert either, so I try to listen to what they're saying. And uh, like I said, there's an, uh, you know, they say you, if you want to, they say you want to get a, a surgery, you know, especially a life-threatening surgery, you know, most people's going to get a second opinion. And that's what we're not getting right now in this country. We're not getting a second opinion about a lot of stuff. That's my buddy right here. Hey, what's going on? Yeah, so that's pretty much all I have to say about that, you know. I don't want to say too much, you know. I don't really know all the Pacifics, you know, but uh, I've seen a lot of disturbing information. That's what I'm going to say. Have you gotten any other vaccines besides the COVID vaccine? Uh, I've taken vaccines when I was uh, younger, but recently, nah, I don't. Because usually for schools, kids have to take vaccines. Yeah, I know. It's mandatory yeah, in most states for kids to take a... Uh, hold up, hold up. It's mandatory for in some states for kids to take certain vaccines, right? Yeah, yeah. And uh, I'm seeing it's looking like soon they're going to probably try to make it mandatory in this country. You know, I know it's already mandatory in a lot of other countries. And in France, they're protesting. Australia, they're protesting. We're not seeing none of that on TV. You know, thousands, hundreds of thousands of people in the streets, you know, because uh, I forgot I forgot what they're about to do in France, but they're about to make it mandatory. I was hearing in DR, one of my uh, friends in, was telling me in DR, you can't even go to the bank if you're not vaccinated. So, yeah, I gotta go you said your friend was saying in DR, you can't even go to the bank if you're not vaccinated? Yeah, that's what I'm hearing. I don't know how true it is, I but... I wonder if that's true. I should yeah. ask my dad, because he just came back from DR. He was there yeah. for like a while. Pretty much, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it, you know, and uh, also to the president of Haiti, you know, he was, uh, he didn't want to have that COVID vaccine and all of a sudden when he died, he just, uh, now they want to have the vaccines in Haiti, so it just, Mm. it's kind of odd also. Mm. So you think the vaccine could have been part of, or him rejecting the vaccine could have been part of the motivation for the assassination? Yeah, him rejecting Big Pharma, yeah. Mm. But wasn't he kind of like a puppet of the U.S.? I don't, like I said, I don't know too much about him. This is really the first time I'm even hearing anything about him. But uh, I know there was three presidents recently killed, and all of them was against the COVID vaccine. Hmm. There was two in Africa and him. Hmm. The president of Tanzania and another country and this school in Haiti. Interesting. I like to look into that, man. I'm not yeah. really too familiar with that. Mm. I gotta go back to work though now. Yeah, I do. I got you, bro. You're a working man. Much yeah, I gotta sign to you, in. I'm about bro. to leave anyway, but uh, I gotta sign in at least. A- any final comments you wanna make? Uh, just uh, anyone that wants to take it, just look into it. Look in, try to look into information that's not being provided by the media. It's the only uh, thing I could say. You know, do what's best for you. All right, thanks for talking, bro. Yep.